hey guys welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel this is ines here and today i'm coming back at you with another vlog right now we are um, a little bit in a rush because we are going to alex's hairdresser he's right here what are you doing <laughs> yeah actually today this is my cheat day so um i have the right to eat uh, something with Alex and even when it's my cheat day I don't go like all all in even though we are going to eat like a chicken burger a Mediterranean Mediterranean how do you say that yes. yeah we're gonna eat that this is one of Alex's favorite burger I think and it's a Mediterranean Mediterranean burger but even though I'm not gonna eat like the whole burger I'm gonna eat it with a lettuce instead of a bread so this is how I've been taking care of myself losing some weight and everything and I feel great so um, Alex have his hair all over the place yep. look at Alex <laughs> with the spike yeah he needs he definitely needs a haircut this is the time the right time so we are gonna go eat the burger and go to do his hair the temperature outside is crazy guys so here in quebec i don't know if it's all over canada or whatever like um the kids they had halloween yesterday but they couldn't even like go outside because there was rain and everything and today it's even like there's so many wine and the wine is actually strong don't you think huh? don't you think yeah it's strong it's strong and i'm like okay they couldn't go yesterday because it was raining like a lot of rain but uh, now it's like pretty dark you know like let me show you guys like the sky how it is i don't know if you can see but it's pretty pretty dark but i don't think you can you cannot tell you know there's a little bit of sun over here but it's getting pretty dark over there so I don't know if those kids are going to be actually able to go get their candies, but I don't know. Me, I remember that when I was young, we went one day, me and all of my friends, for a Halloween to get tree, and there was a lot of rain, so I don't know how come they, they are stopping the Halloween for the rain. But a lot of kids uh, go yesterday with the parents. Oh, they still went? Yeah, it was like a choice of, for the parents. For... Okay. So, but, but I think all uh, here in Montérégie, uh -huh. nobody go. Okay. I think it's today. Okay, so Montreal they go. Okay. Yesterday. So it means that. Wait. It means that they're gonna go. We can go yeah, today, and you can go tomorrow. And they said on the radio that if you go, if you're one of the people who go yesterday, don't go another time. Because the other kid needs the candy. Needs the chance to go. I think I'm gonna go get some candy, guys. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God! Imagine if we were kids and they actually days. did two days for candies and stuff. That's amazing. I'm waiting for the burgers to be ready, and those burgers actually are stuffed inside with pepper, Mediterranean stuff like red pepper. Yeah. Cheese. Uh huh. What else? And something else. Onion maybe. Yeah, but you're gonna see them like once they're ready, they taste amazing. And like I said, me, I'm gonna be using lettuce, so I will show you guys how I do it myself and everything. And Alex, I see that you've been snacking. No. You see the things that I cannot eat? This is a... What is donut? that? Yeah. <laughs> That's a donut filled with sugar. And this is how I need like to not get tempted because this guy right here he eats whatever he wants and he never gets fat but for me it's actually like I need to watch what I eat or else I'm gonna get bigger and everything and the good news you guys is that I lost some weight like since last time I don't know if you can see it actually I'm gonna show you that in a few seconds about uh, 10 kilogram which is 20 pounds, something like that. Are you sure 
Yes, thank you. Oh, yeah. so 20 pounds around. Around 20 pounds. Okay. Why are my shirt? Sure? <laughs> oh, because it's a lot. Yeah, but I go on the scale. But it's been like... Well, you can see on the last video, but it's yeah. been like maybe since the wedding, you know? I don't remember. I rem I know I know I know you lost a lot of weight and I can tell if it's twenty pounds. You never can tell, you know? Like yeah. last year there was a certain moment that I've lost a lot of weight, he cannot tell. Like if I get fat or I lose some weight, Alex doesn't even notice. So what's no, the I point? It. No, you notice that's true. Because right now he's telling me like you're more sexier and stuff like that. But before he I, used no. he used to <laughs> That's not true. Yeah, I'm that's, always so weird. Yeah, that's right. Whatever. <laughs> you're the one I like when I call you sexy. Yeah, because I'm the type of person when I get fat, like actually I don't like it. And it's not like I want to be skinny, 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 but I want to be like, I feel comfortable in my body and me with a little less weight, I feel more comfortable. So that's what it is. And yeah. Woman. Woman. What's with woman? I don't know. Yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> but anyways, and um, well, let me show you. Can you see over here what it looks like? I don't think. Can they even notice that I lose weight or not? I don't think so. We finish eating, we just arrived at the barber and Alex just went like running because he was um, just in time for his uh, his appointment so he went running inside and I was like okay I'm gonna stay in the car and finish what I needed to tell you guys after he has done his hair maybe we're gonna go and finish the grocery for the next week so yeah what i was trying to tell you guys is that we booked our honeymoon yes we booked our honeymoon uh, it's something exciting um, we chose a place that i never even imagined going to you know like you know when you just finished a wedding and there has been so many expenses and stuff like that this is truly a blessing to be able to go where we are going and i'm gonna wait till alex comes back to tell you where we are actually going and everything other than that other than the fact that we booked our honeymoon i wanted to talk to you guys about a book that i've been listening to whenever i do my makeup i'm listening to books you know some people they choose to listen to music me i will listen to books i read sometime but most of the time the books that i read is before going to bed but the last two weeks i've been listening oh my god there's like a truck like a firefighter truck right there <laughs> Like I was saying, the last two weeks I've been listening to a book and oh my god, this has been honestly one of the best books that I've, I've listened to since a while, you know? At first when I bought it on Audible and if you guys don't have Audible, like you can listen to books all the time. Like this is truly something that you should consider having. It's not a promotion or anything like that. That's only me like what i think and how i feel about things but you should definitely think about getting it if you don't use it already but anyways audible is amazing like you know uh sometimes during the day you don't even have the time to read a book but you know like i take about you know 40 minutes to do my makeup sometimes 30 but during that time instead of doing nothing or listening to music i prefer to to listen to a book so this book that i've been listening to that's the book of kevin hart i'm pretty sure you all already know who kevin hart is like he's amazing i used to like not really care about the guy i was like okay he's funny that's a comedian that's all right but after reading his book 
I've like have so much respect for this guy and I think he's one of the most amazing guys ever so smart so humble so um he's amazing truly he's amazing I don't think there's a lot of artists that have the same mindset and the same like way of seeing life as him he's very bright and you can tell like his book has been a laughter you know since he's a comedian i don't know that's him you know i've been laughing from the beginning till the end and he's even talking about really tough situation but while making you laugh you know and like for the first time after reading his book, I went to a comedy show actually. Let me show you a little clip of the comedy show that we went. And yeah, it was very fun and I didn't even know that comedy club, like comedy show club existed you know but now i know and i actually enjoy going there and i have so much respect for comedian because there's so much work they put into that but other than that it's like a life lessons book if you want to see what it feels like to go from nothing to having the success that he has he explains it all he gives you lessons of life that are crucial that i think that are crucial so if you guys have some time uh to I don't know to have a good time that's what I can tell uh, you can go and listen to his book or you can even buy it on Amazon if you are interested I'll... Oh, there's someone random passing by <laughs> yeah I'll leave the links down in the description if some of you are interested or not I'm not paid for that so yeah that's it that's what i've been wanting to talk to you uh, even the cover of the book is the funniest thing ever you know he puts by the way the book came out for a while now but let me see on my phone if i can show you the cover of the book that's what it looks like i bet the book looks something like that as well but anyways that's kevin hart and there's there's a puppy at the top of his head and you know yeah the book looks like that except that you can see this puppy too you know the one that you can't see because it says only from audible the funny thing about that cover is that people ask him like why did he put puppies like in front of the cover and he said because puppies are cute i was like if i put puppies in front of the cover well people are gonna buy the cover because they're gonna think that the puppies are cute and that was only the strategy of the book i found that so funny like that's that's funny to me actually so the wait is finally over mr alex came back from the barber and uh, here it is but no gel yet but uh, yeah but it on is the what side it is. and yeah he's cleaner than a few moments ago and he's not his regular barber because he was uh, <coughs> he was already taken but it's a great job too yeah. so you look uh, fresh mm. right yeah you don't like it mm. it's okay just it's difficult to have another barber barber than the one you're used, used with too yeah but yeah so what i was telling to the people is that um i told them that we are going on our honeymoon are you excited oh yes yeah with the sun the alcohol. sun and everything and you guys gonna be with us as usual right mm -hmm. yeah and uh, yeah where are we going like not exactly the place but at least the the country cancun mexico yeah we are going to mexico and we had a hard time like choosing the place we were first thinking about some many exotic place like far away place and everything and at the end we were like no i just feel like going to a place where we won't have to think about what we eat what we do or anything like that mm -hmm. because we're just trying to relax and that's the most important thing right yes <laughs> eat f food eat eat alcohol pool <laughs> sleep 
<laughs> repeat. <laughs> repeat. <laughs> so I really can't wait to go on our honeymoon. Uh, I feel like this summer it went on so fast because of the wedding and stuff like that and by yeah. the way guys I know that a lot of you you are asking me about the wedding photos the wedding videos don't worry it's coming we are waiting too because we didn't see anything yet except for the little picture that I've yeah. shared with you uh, in our community and the pictures that I've shown on Instagram we haven't seen anything yet we are still waiting and I'm pretty like excited to see the videos and the photos and everything She must at the groceries. Maybe I should try this for my hair. Him being impatient. Do you think I should buy this? Which one? This one, this one, or just this? Alex, it's, it's gonna pop right into your face. Okay, so we just got back from the grocery shopping just finish everything and you saw what Alex eat, ate before going and now he's eating a whole pizza it's a cheat day guys no that, not for you <laughs> every day is a cheat day for you so yeah and I don't know if you guys have this in your house like for us the past couple of days what is it called this thing compost yeah the compost and we are now like obligated to do that so every food we have to throw it in here and the usual garbage in the garbage and then there's the recycle bin so here when you open this i swear it smells so bad right it smells really really bad like there was food from two days like i swear you cannot do more than three days I'm smell. I'm still it's smelling mix, it. Uh, yeah. So yeah, La Alex is adding some things on his pizza. It's, those are. This is a pizza from the grocery store. And yeah, what are we gonna do now? Maybe watch a movie or something like that. Uh -huh. Speaking of movies, we saw the Joker about two weeks ago and uh, it was pretty interesting as a movie i was very 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 scared to see it at first because i was like uh people they were talking so much about the movie so i was like oh maybe it's a scary movie and bad things gonna happen and i don't like to see blood and everything like that so then alex like we went to the movies we were supposed to see uh, J Jennifer Lopez movie you know and because I was telling Alex oh no I don't want to see the Joker people have been talking about it and stuff so I don't want to see that and then when we arrived at the movie I saw that a girl with her boyfriend she was like <laughs> with no problem you know she was like oh let's go see the Joker you know and she was all smiles and she took tickets for the Joker and everybody was taking tickets for the Joker and Alex looked miserable <laughs> <laughs> beside me so <laughs> that's not true and then I, the angel beside us what angel the girl yeah <laughs> yeah when I saw that she's going to see it with her boyfriend with no problem I was like okay maybe I'm over reacting and maybe we should go see that duh yeah so at the end we went to see the Joker and it was pretty good I was at moments I was even laughing like I thought it was gonna be so much more dramatic but it wasn't really what did you think Alex about the movie since you wanted to see it so much it was not what I thought it was why too long not enough wow. action no that's good the fact that it, there was not action it was actually pretty but good the, the, the play was good huh that's not supposed to go in the garbage. <laughs> I'm not used to it. Yeah, and you were screaming at me like a few hours ago when I threw the I don't know what in it's the a garbage. Teamwork. It's a teamwork. Yeah, 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 yeah. And the bread. Good job, Alex. Good job. Anyway.
<laughs> we are trying here so yeah that's what i was telling you about the joker so i found that it was pretty funny because i changed my mind because of the girl and yeah so at the end alex was very happy then i was like next week we're gonna see my movie the one with jennifer lopez and what ended up happening is that next week it wasn't in the movies anymore so guess who's gonna choose the movie tonight alex yeah. do you have an idea yeah. Not you at all. <laughs> Rambo? Rambo? No. Terminator? Even, no, Terminator is not good. So who's gonna choose the movie? That's obviously me. Yeah. And yeah. yeah, I don't know what we're gonna be watching, but we're gonna be watching something boring. Not boring. A love story. Huh? Hmm? Not a love story too. I'm a gonna find story. something. No. Or maybe, maybe a love story, who knows. If this is the end of the vlog, I wanted to tell you guys, thank you very much for watching. Please make sure to subscribe and I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye-bye.